Hello and welcome to Coffee Break Q&A. My name is Michael Moret. Coffee Break Q&A is your opportunity to ask your Bible questions. Send me your Bible questions. I'll do my best to give you a Bible answer. I'm not a Bible answer man, but I'll tell you what I think. We do have a question today, and it is this. I heard someone on radio just yesterday say that Iran has nuclear weapons and they are threatening Israel with war. And that person said that that was a sign that the end was near, that prophecy was about to be fulfilled. Is that true? Well, if that's true, um, then it would have been fulfilled a long, long time ago because they've been threatening Israel ever since they came into existence in 1948. But let's, let's let Jesus answer this question directly because he was asked this question, at least a similar one, by his apostles. He talked about the destruction of the temple and the setting up of his kingdom. And his disciples asked him this question in Mark 13, verse 4. Tell us then, what shall, when shall these things be and what shall be the sign when all these things shall be fulfilled. In verse 7, or actually, yeah, in verse 7, Jesus says, When ye shall hear of wars and rumors of wars, be ye not troubled, for, for such things must needs be, but the end shall not be yet. So, during the church age, between the ascension and the return of Jesus Christ, there will be many wars. There will be much talk of war, many rumors of war, many warnings of war, many wars. But Jesus says, don't be alarmed. Wars by themselves are not a sign of his return. And yet amazingly, many books are written by opportunists every time war breaks out or war is threatened, especially when it occurs in the Middle East. The catalogs of Christian bookstores are stuffed with books that include titles with the words Middle East, Antichrist, Oil, War, Terrorism, Ayatollah, Iran, Iraq, rapture, the second coming of Christ. A lot of tainted money can be made by prophetic hype. But war, even war in the Middle East, is not necessarily a sign of the return of Christ. Jesus said the end is not yet. That's pretty clear, isn't it? Wars are the norm, not just for this present age, but since the fall of man. And so I hope that helps. If you have a question for me, send it to scriptureversebyverse at gmail.com.